Welcome. Good to see you again. How have you been? I see, I see. Well, after our last session, I made some research on your condition. While doing that, I found a new therapy method to cure your problems. Nurse Olaf, can you come and join us? Hello, my dear. I'm Nurse Olivia. I assist here, especially for occasions like these. <laughs> After some proper research and consideration, we came to the conclusion to try the new method out. It's called cuddle therapy. That's right. As you can see, we will both help you out with that. While doing so, your best interest at heart. Do you have any additional questions, dear? Oh, well, that's simple. Last time you told me that you have trouble getting into physical contact with other people, especially if they are your date. Hand-holding, cuddles, kissing, all sort of things. Is that correct? Mm. Oh, no, no. That's nothing to be ashamed of, sweetheart. We have many clients coming in with that problem. It can be a hurdle to overcome sometimes. When we aren't used to getting that kind of affection. Yes. Even though it's new. Cuddle therapy has been well researched and its effects replicated. It's based on the social learning theory of Albert Bandura and considers how both environmental and cognitive factors interact to influence human learning and behavior. And on the cuddle therapy, it's combined with exposition. Which means that by cuddling you, we will show you that there is nothing scary about physical affections. Thus, it will change your thoughts about it and therefore influence your behavior. So, would you like to try out the new method? Thought so. <laughs> Very well. Don't worry, you won't be disappointed at all. We would first start with something light, if that's all right. Okay, good. First, we will start with holding hands. Olive, would you be so kind to... Sure, my pleasure. <laughs> if it's too much, just let me know, okay? So, how does it feel? Mm -hmm. I see. Oh, and do I see someone getting a little red in the face? From that, I'll assume that you like my touch on your hand. Don't worry, that is a totally normal. In fact, that is a really good progress. Not only is it a non-verbal form of communication, it also helps lower stress and reduce pain. Well, you do seem to get more comfortable slowly. That's really great. And once this opportunity arrives in real life, there's nothing to worry about. Believe me, there's nothing you can do wrong when holding hands. <laughs> okay, great. Then how about we go over to the next step? This will include the actual cuddling with both of us. 
Hmm. It's really important that it's both of us so that you can get used to it way quicker. That's why it's called exposition therapy. <laughs> But you don't really mind, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Compliant clients like you are my favorite. After all, we just want what's best for you. Is it alright if I just... And you wrap your arm around me? Oh, much, much better. It makes me feel safe. How does it feel? Unfamiliar. Well, that makes total sense. But don't worry, we are here to change that. Totally. Totally. And I can already tell that you have a very gentle touch. It feels really nice. In the comfort of your body. I hope it's okay that I put my head on your chest. So, what do you say? Do you think you are ready for me to join in as well? Hmm, very well. I'll just... Grab my arms around you from the other side. Is that alright? You're doing so well. You can be really proud of yourself. Every little progress is still some progress. Always remember that. I can say that you are tensing up. Is everything all right? Hmm, I see. Don't worry about us. This is part of our job. We don't mind. Oh, oh totally. I don't mind cuddling at all. <laughs> Especially because it helps to reduce stress so much. But you should always keep in mind that whenever you are in a situation where you cuddle with someone, it's most likely mutual interest. And if you are not sure, it is always okay to just ask. That is true. Communication has a really important role in any kind of relationship. It's better to ask about it than to keep it in, which also may cause misunderstandings in the long run. But now, all you need to do is to let yourself relax and enjoy the affection and personal attention you are getting. Mm -hmm. Not every day will you have the luxury to be cuddled by such two cute and beautiful women. <laughs> I can't complain either. <laughs> Remembering our last sessions and all the insecurities and fears you expressed, you're doing really good. And with concern on your thoughts about yourself and your self-worth, there is never a need for you to think that you are not good enough. You don't need to be someone you are not. You are perfectly fine the way you are. There is no such thing as not being good enough. Each of us is imperfect. Each of us has our own struggles, but in the end, we are who we are, and it's good like that, because somewhere along the way, we will meet people that will like us exactly that way, so never doubt yourself, 
I know, you expressed some concerns about this last time, but it is okay to love yourself. As you forgive anyone else, you should forgive yourself too. Because the relationship of body and mind is just as important as any other. You deserve to take care of yourself. You deserve to put yourself first. So don't let anyone treat you less than you are. Because you deserve to be valued and respected. Just like anyone else. Because you matter too. And most important of all, you deserve to be loved. That is right. So let us love you some more now. Hmm. I can already see that you're way more at ease with us cuddling you. Seems like you started to enjoy it too. Hmm? <laughs> and that is totally alright. You should be. After all, you are getting all the warmth and comfort by cuddling with us. So it's okay now. Just let yourself go. Perhaps close your eyes, even. To fully take in what you feel at this moment. We won't go anywhere. We will be here. With you. Nothing else matters here. It's just you and us. Not your therapist or nurse. Not my client either. We are just simple us. And sometimes it is totally okay not to be or do anything. Sometimes it's okay to just exist and to not worry about a thing because sometimes what we need the most is to have some time for ourselves and taking the time you need taking breaks to find your inner peace to get that rest within yourself that is totally valid. So don't worry about anything anymore. And just let yourself go. Honestly, this was one of my best cuddle sessions. Thank you for being so compliant with our methods. Yes, it really was a pleasure. I'm glad you are my client. <laughs> I hope we can keep making great progress like this. And if anything comes up, any questions or thoughts about this procedure that concern you afterwards, you can always call. I will assist you with that. So, next week again. Same day and time. Okay, good. And note it down in the calendar. I am looking forward to it. <laughs> oh, and if you want, we can practice kissing in the next session. <laughs> oh, and I'm definitely looking forward to that as well.